Ghislaine is a post-war <coughs> detective fiction writer, one of the most popular writers of all time. I mean, his books are some of the most published. He has the highest numbers. He's like in the top ten published authors of all time. Ghislaine, he, was, he served in World War II. He was a pilot in World War II. And when he came back, he decided, he had written four comic books before the war. And he came back and he just wanted to make enough. They bought a house. He needed to renovate it. So he, he, in nine days, he banged out this novel, I, the Jury. Nine days? Nine days on his typewriter with using cheap paper, which is why this paper is brown and crumbly, to use the cheapest paper he possibly could. Uh, uh, he banged it out in single space, which is kind of appalling, um, and just hand correct, made, made his corrections, and gave this to, to a publisher, which I can't even believe they read. The value is all in the signatures. But somebody on the set of the film went to great lengths to get the signatures of producer David O. Selznick, director Victor Fleming, Vivian Lee, Clark Gable, Leslie Howard, Olivia de Havilland, Barbara O'Neill, uh, who is that? Thomas Mitchell, Hattie McDaniel, Evelyn Keyes, Anne Rutherford, Oscar Polk, Butterfly McQueen, Laura Hope Cruz, who's Aunt Pity Pat, Harry Davenport, Howard Hickman. I mean, uh, it's astonishing. There are 30, I think there are 30, three, even down to the children. So here's an aerial photo, look, of the, of the rotunda in Peking. If you can see, you know, they're up several hundred feet. But it's, 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 um, this is also an, an interesting picture. It's a, it's a Western cathedral. In uh, China? In China. So before the revolution, there, you know, there's a, there were some Western influences.